Hi there, I'm Jane from Elna and today we're going to have a look at how we're going to wind the bobbin on our 680 plus machine when we get it home. So when you've got your machine out of the box, you've got all everything ready. So we're just going to look with the bobbins, clear bobbin, you get them with the machine. So we're just going to pop it on the top here. Thread again, it comes off, I run mine off the bottom. And pop that, it goes onto here. Pop the spool cap on the end, make sure you get the right spool cap. And it's through and again we'll see on the top here there's a dotted line for winding the bobbin so it's going one two round the back here follow the dotted line all the way round here don't pop it through here because you will end up cutting it because it's a little blade again you can wind it round you can pop it through one of the little holes it just varies whichever is your preferred method pop that across here and then press the start and we're winding the bobbin. You can alter the speed, the speed control here. And then when the bobbin is full, it will automatically stop and pop back across. But today we're just gonna press the stop start, stop the bobbin, pop it back across. We take it up and then we can cut it here. There are also little blades in the little gray disc that are on the, underneath, so you can trim the thread off in there as well if you want to. So hopefully that's just a little bit of info on how to wind your bobbin correctly. If you need any more, then either just drop us a comment or send us an email into the studio and we can look at that for you then.